Abortion in India is governed by Medical Termination of Pregnancy Act, that is the MTP Act. This act allows both married as well as unmarried women to terminate their pregnancy up to 20 weeks. But uh, beyond 20 weeks and until 24th week, there is only a certain category of women who are allowed to terminate pregnancy. But there was an amendment in the act whereby a particular phrase, married woman or her husband, was substituted by the phrase, any woman or partner. Now, this has been a latest Supreme Court judgment which interprets this particular phrase to include unmarried women. Uh, in this judgment, the Supreme Court allowed an, an unmarried woman to terminate her pregnancy at 24th week, keeping in mind her physical and mental well-being. The relevance of the judgment or the importance of the judgment lies in the fact that it recognizes a woman's right to choose her mental and physical health, which is also in consonance with Article 21 of the Constitution, which guarantees personal liberty. In this case, the woman was not allowed by Delhi High Court to terminate the pregnancy and thereby she approached the Supreme Court. And Supreme Court, while interpreting the amendment, laid down that the phrase any woman or partner very much includes an unmarried woman, that is any single woman is covered by this phrase and she can terminate the pregnancy in 24th week as well if it affects her physical and mental well-being. Uh, this judgment is indeed a landmark step because it recognizes a woman's right to choose her body, to choose what to do with her body and the choose uh, to terminate an unwanted pregnancy if it affects her health in any way. And it also reasserts uh, the very much the scope and purpose of the MTP Act, which gives preference to a woman's health over an unborn child. Uh, this uh, judgment is landmark also in the sense that in changing time, a woman has the right to choose what she wants to do with her body and her marital status should not be a bar to choose the same.